Greetings students, my name is Ms. Kinsey and I'm here to walk you through Class Companion. Class Companion is a generative AI program that we will be using for the writing benchmarks this year. Why do we take a writing benchmark? Well, we all know that learning is a journey and that we're learning all throughout our life. And this is specifically true for writing. When we write, we're improving our writing day by day, year by year. And so it's important for us to understand where our writing is at any given time. So when you take a writing benchmark, don't think of it as a test. Think of it as a snapshot, a picture, a selfie of your writing at this particular time. And you'll be able to monitor your writing and see how you're growing throughout the school year. We're using a program called Class Companion. Class Companion uses generative AI, and you may have heard a lot about AI. What it means for you in this program is that your work will be read by an AI learning model, and then feedback will be given to you that is specific and individual to you and your writing. It's just made for you. And then your teachers will review all of that information and they'll get to decide if they agree or disagree. And then they'll be able to say, oh, well, my students need to work on these types of writing. And they'll be able to help you improve your writing from now until the next writing benchmark that we take. So let's take a look at what Class Companion is going to be like for you, the student. Here's how you're going to log in to Class Companion. It's going to be a little different than when you log into some of your other programs at school. Your teacher will give you a link to your assignment on Google Classroom. So first you will log in to Google Classroom. Then you will click on the assignment. And the third step will be to sign in with Google. We are not using Clever with Class Companion. So when you click on the link from your teacher, you'll get a screen that looks like this. Click on Sign In with Google. Then it will ask you to check, choose an account, choose your name. You will get a message asking if you want to connect your class companion to your Google Classroom. Please click on create class companion account. Then it will say, welcome to class companion. You're all set and ready to do your first assignment. How does class companion work? When you get into class companion, all of your materials are going to be in one place and they're all going to be electronic. All of your sources or articles that you're going to read for your essay will be in Class Companion. There will also be some research questions. These are short questions or multiple choice questions that will be asking you to explain what you've read. Then there'll be an essay. Because there are multiple parts to this writing benchmark, you may be asked to do it over multiple days. Keep in mind that you can also use scratch paper for your writing. So if you'd like to write any thinking maps or other graphic organizers to organize your thoughts, that's a great idea. When I open up my assignment in Class Companion, this is what it's going to look like. It'll have the name of the assignment at the top, and then I can view the rubrics. I can see what are the things that are going to be used to score my essay by the generative AI. So these are the things that it's looking for. So that's always a good idea to take a look at. At the top is the prompt or the task. This is the big topic that you're going to write about. So you can see for this one, it's about economic issues in the United States. <laughs> Below that will be all of your sources. They'll be indicated by something that says source one or source two. At the bottom of every source is going to be a citation for grades seven through 12. The citation is going to tell you who wrote it and what the name of the title was and where it was and when it was from. Immediately following the sources are the research questions or questions that are checking if you understood what you were reading. In this instance, there's a short answer question, a multiple choice question, and another short answer question. That's going to be followed by your assignment. This is what the essay is asking you to write. So this is kind of the task and then some information on how the essay is going to be scored. And then you're going to write in this box feedback. But just remember, you're going to write in the boxes provided. Do not open up a Google Doc. 
In fact, if you open up a Google Doc and you write in it, your teacher is going to be notified that you're in another tab. If you copy and paste from a Google Doc, it's going to say, stop, you can't copy and paste in Class Companion. So write in the box that's provided. And when you're done, you're going to click Submit Final Answers. After you've submitted all the parts for Class Companion's writing benchmark, you're going to be given a score. It takes some time to review your score. Read what Class Companion has recommended that you change next time. If you disagree with a score and you think the AI got it wrong, you can let your teacher know by clicking on this gavel or little hammer that's circled here in red. When you click there, you can write a message to your teacher that says, hey teacher, I think that um, the AI got this wrong and my answer is actually right. This is called a dispute and your teacher will be notified. Thank you for learning about Class Companion. We look forward to reading all of the snapshots or selfies of your writing at this point in the year.